it's been a while since I went to school. I don't know what happened with me. I'm on back to this quirky uh, frame era. Straightforward, but this is how I'm serving you. Straightforward. Long claw clips. Subscribe if you haven't yet. Don't be rude. It's uh, on this side. And uh, you can subscribe. And also, if you don't want to miss up my random videos, then you can put the post notification. You will get it straight away on your feed. You will see it. You won't. You wouldn't miss it. So it's been ten plus years. I haven't and i haven't planned really uni fashion find which i thrifted and have been collecting not really for purpose of going to uni but i was thinking like they are quite uh, maybe interesting if you are if you started uni or school high school or whatever while i got dressed today i do love um street style so i always like to combine some sort of street style element to my outfit because it's just what makes me feel comfortable i've been catching up with gossip girl maxton hall devil Wears brother <laughs> all these movies and tv shows which are relevant to tiny bit to school and fashion and just starting the year like academic years in a september and fall is like perfect timing because summer is finished you can pack slowly your summery stuff away and we are between the seasons where it's not too hot like i'm clearly overdressed today uh, hotness wise because i am literally boiling but in the morning because it was raining in london i was thinking okay i need to put something warmer on and i felt like kind of a bit chilly in the morning but it was like i should have just opened the app on my iphone and checked the weather because i got these um salomon uh, cargo trousers pair it with this Massimo Dutti like massive knit and I was thinking to bring it to the school wipes like a preppy wipe slightly I just throw this pearl oversized uh, blazer over it and I think it works really well and actually what also I've been wearing literally deaf out of is this Keith and Vance collection if you have watched my videos a long time now then you saw like while ago i got massive 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 haul uh, from keith uh, these been serving me so well and first when i got those i was like oh they look like uh, some sort of hospital shoes but honestly they go with everything and i need a new pair they are like slowly slowly getting like I was I was actually surprised that ones is lasting so well because I've been literally wearing it like two plus years in a row now because I think that video was three years ago and that time I didn't wear these loads but like literally in Estonia I was wearing these all the time with my fits because I think I just really figured and hammered down the style I like and now I'm just working on it an eye on my flip-flop era at the moment where i'm figuring things out starting things over whilst i'm 30 plus and um basically single as well so getting my stuff together i've been watching like every evening uh gossip girl as my little guilty pleasure so i was thinking like you know i got the little elements uh from it although like blair and serena style is like more like girly girly Preppy side, I think I bought it like 2000, I don't even know, before 2015, I bought it somewhere in that time. Other side of Ted Baker, this um, shiny, whatever it is, bag, list of cities where I should go. It's my MacBook uh, the Air, um, which is amazing, so I just drop it here, I have the cable here, reusable bottle, YSL concealer, I'm testing out new lip oil laptop this i need to get really laptop back because um, yeah cable and uh, literally that's all when it comes to school uni vibes you cannot look away from hoodies and preppy like hoodies ralph lauren hoodies whatever you like but also like half zip hoodies like corp core uh, wipes as well but it also depends how you are styling it up now. with the skirts trainers boots whatever like even these double boots what i have there on the corner something like that 
uh, this one comes with a hood as well so it adds extra like funny bit details on it but I really I am obsessed with anything like half sips you can just play around how you styling it by like rushing it in options actually on this rack uh, which are going to vintage so it's obviously trousers but they're like straight fit so something with that will look also really cute if you are looking any cute zips like how cute is this especially with light hair yes i wouldn't wear with another sporty thing and as tiktok was saying and track the millennials by the way what socks they're wearing i've been enjoying these hard socks with the patterns and where i'm wearing my key ones with it so i've been updating my socks to turn a bit higher and i used to hate denim I used to hate denim because i didn't know really what type of style to choose uh, what shades of denim and mainly the the difference of the different denims uh, I don't like really stiff denim and I think that's where I went wrong and also I went wrong with the skinny jeans for menswear and I told you previously like I go through menswear like for the pop-up I have also the pop-up video I didn't film too much because didn't have enough footage on the camera i met one lady there and she was like a massive fan of g-star and when i saw this pair I, was, I just remembered her and i needed to get this pair design of this is like what she was talking about so many different details cuff details embroidery front back patchwork so unique pick it up it's not my size at all but I will make it work. You know, just for the styling and stuff. These are so amazing. The pair, like, is so unique. Handbags. So, I do carry, like, big one for my laptop. But also, I like to ha have my phone, my house keys, stuff separate. So, this is another cute find. The stuff was from America. So, I really love this. It is kind of like Louis Vuitton mixed with Michael Kors, but I don't like any, any of them. I don't know, something about this bag, and I think even not with that strap. You notice that I don't follow one style, I don't follow influencers, but holding it like this is so well. Again, if I have my slides, my kids slides, with, I'm so excited to do thrifting again. I'm so excited to, like, to redesign the things. Uh, that's what I picked up like a um, few months ago so I'm trying to hold the hand on the pulse and keep doing this how cute is this denim on denim moment like I mean tells the pockets like this is fully detailed denim jacket and I haven't seen this double jacket really long time I would say like maybe from 2000 era it's not a boxy shape so I mean this Britney Spears Justin Timberlake vibes I'm just all over it maybe like devil wears prada wardrobe moments girl from the chloe campaign is something like could wear and i think it's adorable it's so so nice and especially with some maybe gold or um, maybe even suede bag like a tote suede bag something with it will be amazing combo or add this type of like sunglasses with it like sunglasses are making the outfit i'm telling you about these shoes as i was telling you about the handbag thing i should have actually made it more longer and more detailed video because it was really funny moment in my shopping experience like leather magazine it's like i don't know shoes brand these piccolinos and these are fully leather shoes and these kind of go with this gossip girl preppy style but also they really reminded me the row shoes uh, because of the shape and especially as it comes forward like this like it's like a mesh style of leather so it's fully like transparent and paired with something cute um it's gonna work really well even if i took out my white jeans so with that amazing for the uni tiny bit maybe even emma chamberlain Cousin shoes and white socks for the tiny bit like printed socks. I think before I show you the last piece, I want to keep it the last because that piece is really London ish chic vibe. And I really, 
I feel like with my fashion choices and with my lifestyle and I don't know life in general like before now I was really blasé I was really blasé I'm telling you like everything was like I done that I've been there I done that just extremely neutral about any everything and anything and I didn't have much like emotions going on behind getting ready but I I think I have found a spark back and it's coming slowly I'm working on it um, and I think the choices are like more experimental as well when it comes to my fashion uh, it's not like so same same I hope so at least but also I have to share with you and I don't know what's with these container boxes me and container boxes and like stickers all over them it's um it's new me i want to talk about quickly nail polishes because i think for uni nails are really important to have them neat and tidy uh, especially if you are typing on laptops uh, which is part of the uni nowadays i know you know that i'm definitely dior nail girl especially these two and i'm doing the russian manicures if you want to know more please let me know i can make a special video about this because uh, yeah i don't know if people are to be honest maybe i have to do tiktok series or something a frame era or not um so yeah these are these I fell in love with like this yellowish tones which i never but i just don't moment in here logo inside the glass yet but I feel like the shape is really unique and it's like smaller but now it's a thing like I'm not sure if it works when it's like sunglasses like this and it's just like hanging down on my nose bridge or if I actually change the glass itself I have to think about it like I'm not sure if and inside is like whitish so if I'm not gonna change it should I just keep it or I just gonna sell it on my winter I'm not sure when I stay to my old auntie's house I'm talking about like what people are wearing here and I said you know like it's crazy trend in here to wear like a trench coats like raincoats trench coats beige coats and she's like oh my god I have in my closet and it's staying there for ages like do you want to try it on I tried loads of trench coats but I never found anything which is fitting like this this i think because she's really slim as well um tall and slim her sizes are also smaller so maybe i have tried two big trench coats like i've been trying like large size or something like that but i should have gone with small which was my mistake but this one is really light material and how cute is it's not really like beige it has a hint of this saga grayish tone if you see next to my outfit today you see the greeniness it's slightly like green so it has belt as well comes with a belt this trench is so timeless like it looks like i bought it from Harrods or selfridges it is everything so small lapels i wouldn't say i'm petite i i'm just short i guess i'm shorter um so then this jacket works so well also it doesn't have any stuff on the on the cuff area which i love because then you can just pull it up it has the shoulder uh, buckles and it's like a nice length uh, i don't think she have tailored it in no it's so cute like maybe i should have worn this but again if i want to wear this type of jumper i don't know it's just i think it looks really nice it's ready to go i take my bag and that's my outfit i could throw on these moccasin shoes and it will look adorable and the colors are going so well together and i like when it's like not tone 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 but it's tiny bit like similar color family but it's still like different picks for the uni uh, i have lots of things to put on my vintage as well so you can check it out link is down below you can find it on instagram on tiktok whatever just subscribe put a thumbs up for this video um, you can check my previous video as well which i recently uploaded and um yeah talking about the things i love and i think that's most exciting it brings back 